just wanted to let you know I'm going to take you along on a journey. I'm recording a new single called Can You Stand the Rain, a cover of the 80s classic by New Edition. I'm going to do it in a different way. Hopefully it's going to be pretty creative. We'll see. <laughs> but I'm going to video as much as I can behind the scenes stuff and take you along. Today I'm going to be tracking some drums and hopefully get a little bass in there. Um, let's see what happens. I got laundry going. You can hear it in the background. It's a cold day here in California. All right, I'm about 20 minutes in and I have some drums laid out and I'm using one of my favorite programs called Easy Drummer 2. So this makes life a lot easier when you're not really a drummer. All right, I decided to do some keys or some pads first besides uh, so I can get some vocals in. But check this out. I think this is going to turn out really cool. Creepy. As you can see, I'm down to my last 15 seconds before I need to get into my vocals here on day one. But I came up with this cool little part for the pre-choruses uh, with some piano. So I think it's gonna be cool. I think you're gonna like it. The good times and bad times She will always Always be right are done my voice is a little tired did some background vocals now it's go time to do some editing and we're done for today on a perfect day i know that i can count all right a lot of work done today got some vocals done got a ton of background vocals done got some piano some pad parts uh the drums are a little shaky so i'll probably have to redo some of that but hey this is a work in progress so day one's done Good morning, everybody. Last night, I had a buddy come over and we tracked some background vocal parts. I'm gonna show you that soon. But this morning, I actually was messing around with an intro. I have an idea. I wanna kinda make it a little bit more, almost like a movie trailer intro feel. And I got some violin sounds and I think it's sounding pretty dope. Check it out. Not bad. All right, time is up on day two for me. I've been doing some vocal editing, all sorts of editing today. Uh, not a lot of tracking, but my buddy that came in yesterday nailed some vocals, so check this out. Unconditional, and I'm not asking His name's Rob, and he killed it. Hey girl, to make it last, I'll do whatever needs to be done. Alright, that's it for today. We'll see you on the next one. It's coming along. Today we track some guitars. One of the things that I love to do when I'm tracking guitars is I like to set the mood. For me, I like blue lights, I like darker lights, and let's get it set up. Big week of guitar tracking. We got a lot of guitars to do, but I'm just gonna put every idea that I can come up with. I got a buddy coming in later to do some more. Let's get going. about some bass. All right, guitars are done. My friend came in yesterday and knocked it out of the park. I'm gonna show you that right now. Man, look at all the gray. That's distinguished. Let me give you a taste of the pre-chorus and the chorus. Check it out. That was a fun week of guitars, bass, 
got it all done. It is coming together quick. That's it for today. Today is mix day. I'm on my way to pick up my kids from school, but when we get home, I get to start annoying them and the family for at least a week, if not more. So it usually takes me that long to mix a song. You guys excited? No! All right. No! I'm gonna get going on some mixing stuff and you guys can uh, hang out. Can't let you hear this whole thing. Last two steps. I gotta master this song tonight, submit it to my distribution company tomorrow, and I'm done. I'm grateful and honored for your support, and thank you for joining me on this video journey. And let's go on to the next project. want to remind you and invite you if you haven't already sign up for the email list so you can stay up to date with all the new releases and all the news and all the goodies coming around the corner have a good day later mm -hmm.